record. I just caught the tail end of me going recording. You know what? To heck with it. Welcome back, everybody, to the fourth episode for the next week. Hello! As we continue the e jester, squeaky jester. I'm going to actually just be replacing the cable on my monitor, so if you hear swearing, it's because I'm climbing around in my, my study here, in the cable. Which doesn't have a lot of room in it. Well, being a British house, it has very little room because I'm an ordinary poor British person. <laughs> right. You know the swear? software empire, yes. So. It's getting my Your house is nice. Place. Yeah, it's a nice little house. A little bit of a very English place. Mm-hmm. In an English house. Actually, to be honest, they said, your praise, your house is very nice as well, Jim. Mm-hmm. Just cluttered. Oh, Mine's full of um, computer equipment and World War One and World War Two stuff. <laughs> I've got modern war stuff in there, but... Oh, oh well, that's I well. knew it! I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. I found a dungeon. Found a what? Dungeon. I've been being bombarded by zombies, so I knew there was a dungeon down here, and lo and behold, I just found the darn thing. Are the uh, maps in Minecraft generated, are they? Yeah, they're um, procedurally generated with like a random number generator. But we both both know that random number generators aren't exactly random. No. They're random enough. They do the job. Oh, oh, grommets. Grommets. I'm trying not to swear on your. Oh, Gromit! Claymation for the win. What? Help! Help! It's the hooded claw! Ah. Yes, as much as I probably make fun of all these cultures, I've probably insulted my viewers at some point or another, making fun of, like, France and Germany and Russia. And Britain. And Britain a few times. And, yeah, and Britain. And the States. I've made fun of the States, too. Uh, yeah, he's an equal opportunities insulter. Yep. I forgot where South I was Africa going with this. Night. We did do South Africa. Mm hmm. Insulted South Africa the other night. Why did we do it again? Uh, we were on about South Africans the other night, weren't we? We were insulting South Africa. I don't remember why, though. No, I can't, but we were. <laughs> we were doing, I think it was to do with. Um, uh, was it to do with. Movies? Movies, movies, movies. Meh. Meh. Mm. Whatever. Right. Yeah. Shows how much we remember what we do, too. <laughs> I'm under a desk now, can you hear me? Yep. Well, Sounds like you're desk. under a desk, too. Sorry? Sounds like you're under a desk, too. Oh, that's good. That's bloody where I am! <laughs> well... Yeah, hundred days. Ah, bugger. If you can't see him, neither can I. <laughs> okay, now how the heck do I get back? I think I need to go down there. Hey, Blair. Oh yeah, this running. Ooh, this way blimey, that's better. Hmm, picture better. Yes, much. It was very good before. Um, I've been impressed with this monitor, and then it moaned, and now I've put this in. I've got oh, blimey, yeah, I'll see your point. <laughs> now the monitor is like, told you so. So yeah, they're becoming self-aware. You've plugged in the wrong cable. Now you see, it can't be cool. Skynet, because I help build Skynet, and I know it's not self-aware. <laughs> We've got partially by my, tested by my software. So I know him. Um, I found my tunnel home. What? Yay! Tunnel. Yeah, tunnel. 
I've been underground this entire episode. Chair. Just a chair. Yeah. Well. A V heavy chair. Employees and Detroiters. That's not Detroit. Detroit. Oh yeah. <sighs> I hate flying, and I've got to fly tomorrow. Where are you flying? Oh, you're flying over to St. Louis. <sighs> Right, let's have a quick look here and... Oh my life, eh? Well, maybe after the next episode here, because I've got to do one more of these for the five days of the week, one each each day, we can play some war game. Oh, that would... that's gonna, I'm going to be checking out a little bit of... Um... Oh, Europa. Yeah, I'm just... Uh, yeah, but don't, don't stop. If we're going to play war game, we'll play war game. Mm -hmm. Definitely. I'm most, most certainly up for that. Hopefully we don't have to deal with Obama again. I think in the coming crisis of the next few days, and ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking. It's the 17th of July, so it's the day of the airline crash in um, Ukraine, which appears mm -hmm. to have been shot down. But right, I haven't even checked the recent news, so let me just have a quick look. Time now in the United Kingdom is 25 to 9 in the evening, so that's 25 British Standard Time, which is 25 to 8. General Greenwich Mean Time, so you can work your times out as to what time of day it is from that. It is kind of late there, isn't it? But it's a Thursday. Hooray, Thursday! That much closer to Friday! That much closer to Saturday! And then Sunday of misery because you got to go back to work tomorrow. Unless you work weekends, then, well, that just kind of sucks. Maybe. Ah, back to the house. Back to the little wee base. Is there anything on the news? I do have, uh... Right. Uh, Recent the news here, um, the Ukrainian military points out they had no fighters in the air at the time. Trust me, NATO will know that because oh, they're yeah. running our airspace with some severe stuff. And also, their air defence batteries are further back for obvious reasons that they are worried about a Russian attack. So their air defence batteries are further back. Mm -hmm. Also, why points, would they deploy them to the front anyway? The rebels don't have aircraft. Correct. No need for them. Mm -hmm. So, here's the, somebody called the Major, supposedly, has said cross Cossacks from the Chernikino roadblock supposedly have shot it down. How, why some chaps with the roadblock have shot it down, I don't know. But. Why does a roadblock have a frickin' book? <laughs> That's another question. What twat deploys oh, a book in a roadblock? I also, when I, whenever I use books in bloody war game, I need to fire three missiles sometimes to get a hit. Well, yeah. But also here we're talking about a civilian airliner that may not even know what's being shot at. So what did, do, what did do any invasive maneuvers or anything? Somebody looks out the window and goes, why is that telegraph pole getting bigger? Yeah. There's not a heck of a lot they can do to avoid it. It's a 747. They're not exactly maneuverable. No, it's a Boeing, tre Boeing Treble 7. Oh, Treble 7. Yeah, so that is better. I got it confused with that 747 that was shot down during the yeah. 80s or something. 1983. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh. There's a giant cocked-up mess. We dark days in the 1980s. Russia was belligerent. We were in a Cold War situation. <laughs> belligerent, really? Actually, they weren't particular. It was a happy balance. 
Everybody was happy knowing exactly where they all stood. Yeah. Why is this thing not working now all of a sudden? Oh my, this is pretty. What the hell was that? Probably you can all hear Europa Univada style. Oh up. yeah, that's the intro sound. I had the sound turned down, I didn't remember it. Oh, the fonts look beautiful. Now, I had some trouble with fonts, thinking it looks a bit crap, but... Oh, yeah. I haven't even got my glasses on, blind old Pew, and even I can see it looks absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, the, the, those guys, that studio, make some really high-quality games. They do. Complex, but high quality. If you want a game that's complex and barely understandable, go to those guys. They'll do it for you. Oh, they're real stat hands. I'm looking forward to having a go trying to play it. I think my wife's just talking about the beer. I say. I have a bunch of oh, material man. down here. No, that's not nice. President Obama wants to be my friend. I've got loads of people wanting to be my friend. What, you loaded... Oh. Wait, you loaded War Game? Yeah, I just want to check it out. Oh. Yeah, every time you play with Obama, he's gonna, gonna want to try to invite you to be his friend. Every time. I don't know of anyone who's accepted it. Whoa! Where'd you come from? Fuck off! That means it's dark here. I'm out of torches. Bing! I've been tempted to accept it just so he can invite me into games. I know to be on the opposite side of the game of the. Well, that would be quite fun. <laughs> oh, oh, you've yeah. invited me? Sure, you're playing NATO. Great, I'll play Pact. Oh, you're playing Pact. Great, I'll play NATO. Find out where he is on the front line and just focus my army there, because that'll be a points factory. Just an absolute points factory. As we could tell from his score in the previous game, where the only reason why the enemy won is because, well, yeah, that dude. Just giving them points. For all intents and purposes. And there's a reason why I went down there, and I did find some quartz. Not that much quartz, which is kind of surprising. Are you still there? Yeah, I'm listening okay. to you. Oh. I'm just mumbling. Okay, mumbling's good. Yep. Uh, Might one case shelf. So what is it that I want to make? Ah, oh, yes, ME controller. ME controller, which required a phone call. Of course, I'm recording, which means I must be interrupted by a phone call. Oh, but it wouldn't be a, I wouldn't be a call from me. No. Hello? Uh, yeah, hold on a second. And we are back. Hello? And we've lost Simon. Uh, just oh, I'm here. <laughs> I'm here. Let me just. Get to, I'm going to put you back and uh, back in my headphones. Mm -hmm. It was a uh, please give us money phone call. Ah. Mm hmm. Everyone's favorite thing. Give us money for we have none. Extras from the NRA. <laughs> Who has plenty of money? They they've gotten my. Lifetime membership fee, about five times now. Who's that? The NRA, National Rifle Association. 
I am I'm a member. I'm a member of the NRA, the British one. <laughs> Wait. I said... There's a British NRA? Yes, I'm a member. National Rifle Association? Yes. Hmm. I didn't know that. So... Didn't know they existed over there. Yes, I'm a member. <laughs> yeah, they call here and ask for money all the time. And I'm amazed they keep calling me because I keep giving them the same answer. I don't have any. You're on a phone list, that's what it is. Um, yeah. My cables are... Pro probably on a phone list because I don't just simply hang up on them. Probably. Are you, you're going to lose me for a second, guys, because I'm going to unplug my headphones and unsort this cable out, which looks to me like a real cat's cradle. Mm. Bear with me. Back in a minute. That made a nice sound. As long as he's not lost. Okay. Iron, 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 and those. So it means I need these, and I mean these, and I need that, and I need this, and I need a question mark, and I need that. That's that, that's that, that's that. One, two, three, four. Dooby dooby doo. Dooby 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 doo. Ballsy 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 balls. Ding. Wait a minute. Nope, I'm building the wrong thing. I need that. Oh god, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Yeah, I probably had the capability to make what I needed to make, and now I most certainly don't. Uh, that's the entire re reason why I went mining. Was to finish this computer. And I blew it. Bluey, bluey, blew it. Doo -ba doo blew it. Screw it. I'm gonna make mining easier. Jumpy, 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 jump, jump, jump. And this episode will end shortly anyway. That's probably... This might be the book I wanted. Alloys. Hello? Iron, blood, and emeralds. Mmm! Diggy, diggy, ho! Yep, and that's the alarm for this episode. Oh good, I came in, my last phone was diggy diggy <laughs> ow. Yes. Is... Uh, so, I hope you all have been enjoying. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe these to these videos. Share, it all really helps out. Comment too, I do actually read all the comments. Most because there isn't all that many right now. But I do read all the comments. And uh, don't forget to, to uh, follow me on Twitch as well when I live broadcast these things. I'll be seeing you all later next episode, which will, for me, be about five seconds for you guys tomorrow. Uh, yep. See you tomorrow. <laughs>